Hello YouTube, quick tonight's video for you. These are mussels. You can see the one to the left. You see that white thing? It's alive. That's its tongue trying to dig out and pull itself into the substrate. They feed from the other side. They've got like two holes that siphon through the water and uh, suck it in and spit it out. Anyway, the reason these are in here is because I keep bitterlings. Now, bitterlings are very unique fish. They have like a giant egg tube and on the female, and she'll insert that egg tube into one of the two holes on the other side, the opposite side to where that tongue is. And she will insert, her, insert that and lay her eggs inside of the mussel. At the moment they're not coming over. I was hoping to get a little bit caught in action. But because I'm here, they're nervy. So they're literally one foot away at the moment. So I'm going to try and step back and see if they come over. Might not because I'm here, like I say. But there they are. Oh, sorry about the glare. Those two there are both males. They're red, more colourful. The first one, yeah, is the dominant male. may go and have a look. The others are following. There's two females. Like I say, they're very unique fish. This one at the back here is full of eggs at the moment. So I'm expecting them, excuse the reflections, I'm expecting them to go and select these mussels and a male to start protecting one of them. As I say, they need these, these won't breed without the mussels. It is a, it is a symbiotic relationship. The mussels also return the kind of favour they release their spores into the water, which get attached to the fish's gills, which can cause them damage, to be fair. But, that's nature. You can't have one without the other. So, fingers crossed I get some breeding action for you over the next couple of days. But, like I say, there's plenty of information around where you can get on bit of limbs. I hope to get these to lay in here, and if they do spawn in there, I won't know to five to six weeks until the fry get ejected and pop out. One more quick look. Two females at the top, and the males being redder. See that one to the right? It's full of eggs. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Look after yourself. Peace.